Hey everyone, it's Adam with the 40K Formula, and I'm going to shoot a quick video here by request uh, for one of our members that uh, wants to know how to grab images uh, from the web. And uh, there's a really great tool called Jing. And so what you want to do is you want to just go to Google and uh, type in the word Jing, J-I-N-G. It's a free service. Um, it's uh, made by this company called TechSmith. So you want to click on that first link. Uh, you want to go here and uh, you want to click that free download. Okay, so once it's downloaded and installed, um, you'll go to your programs, your applications if you're on a Mac, start my programs if you're on a PC, uh, and you'll have it running in the background. So what it'll do is it will create um, this, and maybe I should just log out, let's see if I can, if I can actually log out. Well, when you, when you select the program, it's going to pop up like this, and um, let me quit here. No, let's see. Let's just, uh, yeah, okay. So what it'll do is it'll uh, it'll minimize itself to the side of the screen, and it'll be this little sunburst on the side of the screen. You can pick this up, and you can move it anywhere you want. If you want it over here, um, you know, wherever you want. So I just happen to have it right over here. So when you're doing an image search, uh, and this is specific to um, uh, members here in the 40K formula that are looking for images. Uh, for to um, to attach their syndicated content. So what I always do is uh, let's just use the word happy because I'm happy right now. Um, and uh, we type that into Google search and then we go to images. And there's all kinds of happy uh, pictures here. Um, I'm just using this as an example. You can uh, you can grab you know anything from anywhere, but uh, instead of um, saving. Because if you right-click on one of these, you can save save the uh, the picture. But let's say you want to do a screen grab, uh, and this one's actually kind of cool right here. So I'm clicking on this. Okay. Um, also, you can click on more sizes over here if you want uh, a particular size. Um, let's say 480 for 480. So there it is. So just to save the image, um, all you need to do is right-click uh, and select uh, Save Image As. That will save the JPEG image. Um, but we're talking about uh, the actual um, image itself in the URL that it lives on, where it lives on the internet. So you would click on view image, and right there is where the, uh, the URL for that image lives. But let's say that you wanted to take this image and put it, um, you know, host it yourself off the free service uh, of, of actually, um, um, I don't think it's Jing, I think it's called... Uh, Screen capture. Hold on, we'll see one sec. What is it? Um, so what I'm doing is uh, let me just back up there to kind of do that one more time. So what I'm doing is going over to my little sunburst here, and I'm clicking on the plus. Okay, that's and you see these crosshairs show up. So the minute that you hold down your mouse, so I'm going to kind of put this up here into the top corner. The minute you hold your mouse down, then you can start ranging the picture that you want to snag. Okay, so now it's selected, and you'll see these icons show up on the bottom. Here's the capture size right here. So then if you click, I'm going to mouse over the left button here, capture an image. Okay. Now you can all, you can either name the image here or you can leave it with the date and the, um, uh, the chronological number that it gives. You can do two things. You can either save it to your hard drive here or you can share it via screencast. That was the name of the, uh, the website. This is, again, another free service. So if I hit share via screencast, See right here, it's uploading to Screencast. Give it a second to upload. And then now it's ready to, uh, to view. So here, you click this link right here, View on Screencast. So here's the image now on Screencast. Up here is the uh, directory that it's in, but that's not the image link. Okay, so you need to click on the image for it to reveal the image link. Now, this is the image link. You can see, this is see my user folder here. You might uh, it's to set up screencast. I think you might have to set up a free account. But so there it is. So now uh, you can take that link image and go over to your social sharing program, which is uh, the one that we were talking about that we're, that we're using right now is my social empire. Um, so once you go in there and you click on link creator, uh, down here under the image URL is where you're going to uh, to paste that image and it's going to show a nice little image icon of your um, blog post once you put in um, the destination URL, uh, the title, a little bit of uh, page description, and a URL slug. So um, so that's it for uh, the little tutorial on the Jing um, 
uh, image capture program. It's fantastic, it's quick, it's easy, and it's free. Hope you enjoyed. Have a great day. Take care, guys.